up you guys it's tiffany mia and if you are new to this channel welcome and if you're returning glad to have you back in today's video we are going to do a unboxing and review of confectionery soaps company i actually heard of them through instagram and i've heard nothing but good things about them so let's see if that's true you may be wondering why i am sitting to the side and it's because we have a special guest for today's video mr pop cult i'm your humble host not your channel <laughs> <laughs> in today's video we are just doing a review we are actually not sponsored by confectionery so we bought these items with our own money we just want to give you guys an honest review so let's get started so this is how the box talk about the process oh okay, okay. you know you talk about the process okay. so when we were ordering these items i actually saved the date on my phone because I knew that they were going to launch out a new collection, uh, a fall collection. And from what I heard, they sell out pretty fast. So as soon as it hit 6 p.m., which is when they opened the website to everybody, we were on there and things were selling out so fast. We actually added them to our cart. And as we are going to pay, they were saying sold out, sold out, sold out. So we had to be really quick um, and purchase what we could at the time. So yeah, we had a bunch of stuff in the cart that never even made it to check out. Once we put them in the cart and we hit check out, it would notify us like these items in your cart are no longer available, they're sold out. So once we started seeing that, we just ripped whatever items we had in there and just kind of hope for the best. So the ordering process was pretty easy. Uh, the checkout process was straightforward, like any online store that you would buy from and it took about two exactly two weeks for the product to uh get to us yeah so the collection came out august 27th on a friday and it literally got to us yesterday on september 10th friday so so this is how the package came it's pretty cool because they have a confectionery soap company tape i thought that was a nice touch because they could have just put regular masking tape on it but they have like their own brand logo tape i thought that was really cool try to hide our address so guys, if I could have your attention for a very serious moment, we are skipping the safety briefing for this video because the box has already been pre-cut. So I absolutely love how they actually put a themed tissue paper in here and wrap it with a bow. That is such a like nice- a gift, like a legit gift, not just- Such a nice touch. Something you order online. Love yeah. it. All right guys, so let's see what we got. I hope you guys can see this, it's really cool. Wow. So she provided us, um, I say she because I believe the owner is a, a woman who actually started her company in her own home, I believe. So uh, this is a pamphlet of her fall 2021 uh, collection. So this is really cool. Oh, it looks like they included in here like a proper candle care like guy, that's pretty cool because sometimes you just light a candle and you don't know that there's actually maintenance that needs to be done, like trimming the wick and things like that. So this is actually really nice for people who aren't candle connoisseurs and maybe this is the first time that they buy like legit, what I call gourmet candles. So we have the things obviously we're seeing in here that we know we ordered, but this is really cool guys. We actually have like some extras in here that we didn't order, but are more like samples, so. We have a Yule log. It looks like a bath bomb. It's a bath bomb. Okay. So it's else? a sample, tiny sample. And then we have this Avatar Flight body wash that looks glittery, but it's pretty nice. I'm interested in this because it says maple bourbon and you know I like anything that's like food related. What wax melt sample. Oh, cool. Oh yeah, that's awesome. So if you have a wax melt, I mean, you can add that on there. We don't have one, so I guess we'll have to buy one. Oh yeah, because I want to try this for sure. Yeah. Can awesome. we smell it? Can I open the smell? Wow, that smells really good. I just want to eat it. <laughs> it smells you know, really oh, good. You know what it's giving me, like vibes it's giving me? It's not, it's not but it kind of smells like candy corn. I, the, the consensus is like very divided. Some people love candy corn, some people hate it. Mm -hmm. I don't mind candy corn. It is like eating candle wax, but the smell is like very maple. I love it. 
And not because Very I like candy yeah. corn, but I, I I like that smell. That's awesome. Pull the next thing out. Okay, pull out some of these things. Look at this. What is this? Is this, all, is this our order? So they provided us with our order list um, and images of each of the items that we purchased. Let them know what we got so they can know what to look forward so to. So we actually got a Avatar Flight fragrance oil for the diffuser, uh, marshmallow bonfire candle, boo bash candle, Interesting. warm and cozy candle, the tavern candle, churl's candle, yes. candle, candle, candle. <laughs> Um, and the last one is the black flame candle, which I'm so excited for. That's the one that caught my attention when I was on their website, and that's the one that made me buy all the other ones. Yeah, big Hocus Pocus fans. Yes. Uh, guys, there's honestly really nothing else much to look into. It's just they're all bubble wrap, so we'll take them out individually and kind of show them to you. Which I love that they're bubble wrapped, yeah. which is it's very neatly organized in here. All right, let's see which one this one is. I hope these smell good. I'll be so disappointed. There you go. Do you want first waft? Sure. First whiff? I don't know, is waft. it waft or whiff? No, waft is, I think we need to do that. Okay. Bomb? Really good. And the size is pretty good. I like the design on it. It has like a plaid design. Um, this is more like a Christmas gives me Christmas vibes. Okay, I wanna like let the, I want the smell to build in there so I can pull it off and let it rip. Yeah, Christmas vibes for sure. Smells Ooh, really yeah, good. I, yeah, I, I get what you're saying. That does, yeah. it, it smells to me like a little bit more like winter vibes for sure. Wintery vibes. Yeah. Um, Which is still good. vibes. Yeah. yeah. Really good. Okay, next one. Wow. I'll do the honors on the next one. They come bubble wrap in their own like individual pouch. I think that's so awesome. Like that's such good attention to detail. Ooh, the, the tavern. tavern. This is I think one that I picked. I was like, I know this is gonna smell like bacon and I love anything bacon candle related. So yeah. I think, can I get this one like first smell? Yeah, okay. go ahead. Thanks. You deserve it. Ever in this. <laughs> what, is it good? <laughs> yeah, it's, it is exactly what I love. I know you don't, she's not really a bacon person, but it is like literally the scent that Everything I- Everything you were hoping for? I was hoping for, yeah. Okay. I'm burning that on my the side tavern. of the room. Okay. This is literally <laughs> bacon. Like it's, it smells like- Yeah. Like I bacon. would've, I would've, so like she said, we're not sponsored by, Got my knee. So like she said, guys, we're not sponsored by Confectionery Soap Company. This is just an honest review. These are candles that we bought with our own money. So we're gonna be honest. In my personal opinion, yes, I love the smell of bacon on that. I wish it would have been a little bit more like maple-y, like almost like a little sweeter. It, it is, it's like a strong bacon, which yeah. I know I'm gonna love. But if I were like burning that candle in my room, yeah. I'd burn it maybe with a little bit of maple. You wanna open this one? So this one is the Boo Bash candle, Disney inspired. So this one I was most interested in because like, what does Boo Bash smell like? Like, right. like obviously tavern, you know, you're gonna know you're gonna have like some hearty smells, you know, warming cause like some of them you can tell the smell just by what the name of the candle is, but what does a Boo Bash smell like? We'll find out. Honestly, it smells like coffee. What? And it actually has glitter on it too, which is pretty cool. It's very glittery. It's on the label. And it has the um, Magic Kingdom Castle on the label. Um, that's typically where they do the boo bash um, during Halloween. Going in for the fourth sniff. It's serious. Yeah, well, hold up. Let me get the, I gotta do the, yeah. Sorry. I gotta do the setup. Let it collect. Do it's you... not coffee. Okay. I'll tell you what it is, it's chocolate. Chocolate? Yeah. Makes sense, it's, Halloween. It's, yeah. 
candy. It's not, it's not, it's not really coffee. And maybe it has like a hint, maybe like a drop, if, like a dash if they're putting like candle oils. Mm -hmm. But it's, correct me if I'm wrong, if anybody knows, or maybe, is it on the website maybe that says like what's in them, like the scents that are in them? If not anybody sure. knows somebody from confectionery soap company, correct me if I'm wrong, I think this is chocolate. Yeah, I think it's chocolate. I'm getting that now that you mentioned it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I'm feeling this one. Okay. I'm not a big chocolate fan for those of you who does don't know that. not eat chocolate, does not eat bacon. Yeah, so. That won't be. So far, the warm and cozy is my favorite. Up next, ooh, I think I'm really gonna enjoy this one. You know how much I love a marshmallow bonfire. Nice. I love the labels. Yeah, they're very unique. Very they're unique. very cool. Here, you get the first smell. Thank you. Actually, it's your turn. That's fine. You can do the honors. Because I want to smell that churro one. On this label, it actually says uh, two milk chocolate bars, eight large marshmallows, two graham crackers. Not sure what that means. As soon as you said that, I went to go check the Boobash one, but that, that label doesn't say it. I don't think they all do, but that one's, that one's cool that it tells you how much. I mean, I guess what you think it would smell like. Awesome. Okay. Thing. Smells good. I'm getting that bonfire smell. I actually really like this one. You like that one? Yeah, so okay. I want to see what you smell. <laughs> I sniffed too hard. I got nothing. All right, let me try again. smoky smell do you get that three years later one eternity later i don't know you don't know i don't know maybe okay so this is where i'm wrong and i'll admit it mm -hmm. i'm a little biased because one of my favorite candles from bath and body works is the marshmallow fireside so I'm, I'm being very biased and almost like I want it to smell kind of like that, but I'm not getting that same vibe. It is a unique smell though. It's different. It's not like it's overly light, sweet. Yeah. yeah, it's very light. Very it's like a light. subtle campfire, which I think will actually be good because sometimes the other one's like a little overwhelming to be honest. So I think this will be good. I, and I also think that I, that when you burn them, they're gonna have like a different smell or not. So, I think so. Yeah, maybe That's not so much like a different happens. smell, but like, a, a softer smell. Right. What do you think? Uh, or a more intensified smell. We don't know. Oh, last. Oh, this is the last. Yeah. All right. The last candle or not? No, we got one more. Yeah. Who's that one? The one that I've been waiting for. Is it true? No, it is the. Oh, the black candle. Yeah, I'm interested. Black candle. Yes. On All Hallows Eve, when the moon is round. A virgin will summon them from under the ground. Am I a virgin? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure you want me to do the? Let me do the sure one. I feel like you really deserve to. I love smell the label. First. Yeah, sure. It gives me Halloween vibes. So this is the front of it. It has two candles on the side, and then up here you have the famous saying from the movie and a little cut. All right. Is that I don't even know what this would smell like. That's what's so interesting about it. Here we go. Please. <laughs> um, it smells like a specific candy. It smells like a, a candy and I don't know what type of candy it is. But it is black. Don't say licorice. <laughs> it's not licorice, is it? I don't know. It's uh, no, it smells like grapes. Give it to me, I'm gonna crack the code. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if I'm feeling that one. I'm gonna tell you right now. What is it? I think you were on with the grape. It has a grape scent to it, yeah. It does have a grape scent to it. 
But we don't. Not is, we a don't candy know. though, right? You don't get like a hint of sort of candy. No, I'm gonna tell you exactly what great candy it is. It is a great candy. Jolly Ranchers. What, bro? What are you talking about, man? Hold on. Jolly Ranchers is one of my favorite candies. Hold on. I can see that. Um, I just don't know why it would smell like this. I don't know. I, I, what, what would you? Can we burn this one? It needs to be burnt by a virgin. I got this. What scent would you have done for this specific candle? Cat. <laughs> I don't know. What... More like a hollow, like, what are Halloween scents? Well, that's the thing. Like, you can't just do pumpkin on everything. That's true. You know? Like, this is unique. I've never, first of all, I've ne I didn't even know great candles existed. And we're, like, we're not knocking it, but we kind of are. And I feel like we're not giving it a fair shake. That's not right. One more time. I feel like these will smell different Can once we burn they're- it? Can we burn this one? I'm gonna light this one, fulfilling the prophecy, and we're gonna let it yeah. burn while we do the next can- No, it's gonna, it's gonna mess up our scent. Yeah. Let's open up the next candle. And when we open up the next candle, as we finish the video, we're gonna burn that one so we can give you a honest kind of like review at the end of this specific one because I really had high hopes and I still think it's a banger. I have not given up on this candle yet. Let's see what's next. Churros. My favorite. This one I'm gonna smell first. I do not care. Show the label, show the label. Sorry guys, I got excited. Yeah, I got excited. <laughs> Churros. Is that a, a Mickey on the side of it? What is that? It is. It's like a little holiday Mickey. You can see how like Mickey mouth. Feel it. What? Tell me it smells like churros. I'm gonna tell you what it smells like. And it's and not churros? It is not churros. It's still good. You're gonna probably like it more than me because you know I don't like this particular thing that it smells like. Okay. But it's not churros. I'm getting cinnamon. For sure. What does it smell like specifically? I don't know. I, I just smell cinnamon. What are you what are you thinking about? Big red. The chewing gum. Right? Yes, so, I do get that. Yeah, big red chewing. I do not like it. I do not like it. I do not <laughs> like chewing big red bubble gum. It's like peppermint. Or... That's exactly what this candle smells yeah. like. I don't know why it would be in a churro. I'm confused. Last thing we ended up ordering before we burn our candle, I think I want to do this too. Like, I want to do this. I want to do this for the video for you guys. We got um, some essential oil. So a little backstory. Oh, okay. Sorry to interrupt you. <laughs> we love the flight of passage ride at Animal yes. Kingdom. The like Avatar the ride. ride. It's the best ride that they have at Animal Kingdom, and I don't know if you guys have been on the ride, but. They spray. I already smell it. They, Bless. They spray a scent that is amazing. We love it, and we literally go on that ride just to smell that scent. And this one, this scent, and the black candle were the two items that I was just like, I need to have these. So this is a essential oils for a diffuser, and this is Avatar Flight. Which I'm hoping really. Sm I mean, I already. I mean, I smell it already. You do? Okay, I yeah, smell me it. too. Oh my god, it's I, I so know. Good. I'm so excited. So, I actually think I want to put this on for you guys so we can do a little like. Um, and it's a pretty big bottle, so. Yeah, it's a decent amount. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. So she should do. We actually love Pirates of the Caribbean too because oh, they yeah, have a be. a very. Unique. unique scent when yeah. you get on the ride. Please do one. For pirates. If you're watching. She's not watching. Wow. It smells just like it. 
Um, this is scary. That's like, she, like yeah, perf it's like the perfect. This is, what does the scent smell like? It's like very fresh. It's like forest? It's like Pandora. Yeah, Pandora. This by far is my favorite item from this order. Yeah, yeah. I mean, not knocking the candles. We're super yeah. excited about the candles. We're gonna burn all of them. Um, but for sure, I can't wait to put that oil into the diffuser. Let me, let me, let me burn this candle for you guys. All right, I'm gonna burn the black flame candle. Oh, come on, it's just a bunch of hocus pocus. <laughs> Don't play with fire. <laughs> Overall, you guys, the packaging looked amazing. I love the uh, tissue paper theme that they chose. It took about two weeks for us to receive it, which I was okay with. Yeah, it's, that's like totally reasonable shipping for a package that's like coming from like a small business, kind of like somebody that's making their own business, not like a big company. You know, Amazon comes in two days, but they're not making candles in their own houses. So I think this is a uh, really cool and it came super fast, I guess, in yeah. my opinion, you know? So uh, I love the small samples that she provided in the package. That was a very nice touch. And we really appreciate it because we get to try some of her other products and maybe we can buy them in the future. Uh, overall, I did like the candles. I was disappointed with some of them, but I think once we light them, they will um, smell different. Which one did you disappointed in? I think I was disappointed with the boobash and the churros. So. Yeah, I, I would agree. I was, I well, I can't really say I was disappointed in the boobash because I didn't really know what to expect. So I, I wouldn't say I'm necessarily like, disappointed. I'm just, I think I'm more interested to see how it's gonna smell once we actually burn it. So while the candle burns in another room, that way the fragrance from that one doesn't intermingle with what we've got going on over here. We'll get back to that. We've got our air diffuser. No oils in it, just plain water. <laughs> so it smells like nothing. <laughs> but we're gonna add our Avatar Flight and uh, we'll see what kind of smells we get out of it. I'm actually like super excited for this and I can't wait to use it while I go to sleep. Maybe like four or five drops. All right. <laughs> that was four drops, Overdose I promise. Overdose on Avatar. <laughs> All right, so let's see what this smells like. Where's the lid? It's right here. The lid. The lid, 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 the this is really I good. Like this is, this and is, then we did four drops, so four is enough, I think. Four is perfect. This is the experience I have been dying to have while I sleep. Yeah. This, turn, I don't wanna say too loud, to Alexa, to play thunderstorms and it's a wrap. We're going to sleep. I mean, yeah. there's nothing that can wake me up. This, this was worth it. Yeah, So bring it back up here. Overall, really good experience with confectionery soaps. We will definitely buy um, more products from her. Yeah, and hopefully be faster. Yes, we do have to be faster when we're ordering things from her website, but I hope that she does more diffusers because when I went onto her website, she only had this one, I believe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The other, I think she had two or three other ones, but they were sold out. Uh, I hope she does more, uh, diffusers based on off of rides at Disney so oh, I'm, if she does a Pirates one Pirates of the Caribbean that would be awesome that's one of the other rides that yeah. has a really nice scent so I hope that she watches this video and sees that so yeah. really good I love it all right so we have let it burn for about 45 minutes um, we lit the black flame candle yeah and it does smell like grapes we have confirmed that it is it is a definite yeah. This is wafting. I think this is wafting. <laughs> yeah, it's it's great. It's I mean, I could be wrong. We could just be all. We just have bad noses. Yeah. But I think it's great. It's not bad. It's actually pleasant though. I wouldn't mind like Very lighting. Very subtle. Candle. So. Yeah. That's actually good. I don't like a candle that's like so strong that it like overpowers. I don't want it to overpower my diffuser. 
All right, guys, so that is it for our confectionery soap unboxing and review. Overall, we had a very good experience with confectionery soap, so we are definitely going to buy more products from them in the future. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. It would really help us out. And hit um, the bell notification so you're notified when more videos come on Tiffany Mia's channel. The expert right here. So I'm glad to have you on the channel today. Thank you Thanks. for joining. I'm your humble host, Mr. Popco. Thank you guys for watching and see you soon.